Hey fitness enthusiasts, welcome to Vadim Fitness Studio. Lately I've been getting a lot of questions from people who start returning to their fitness clubs and gyms and require to wear a mask. Is it bad to wear a mask when you're working out? Are you deprived from oxygen? Are you inhale carbon dioxide? Is that bad? Are you getting headache because you're wearing a mask and not getting enough oxygen? So I decided to conduct a little experiment to show you. So I'm wearing two blood oximeters. They're two different companies, but both use in medical clinics to measure blood saturation of oxygen. So everything above 95 is considered to be a good blood saturation, oxygen saturation. So this one shows 98. This one shows 99. They both have about 2% margin of error. So, but it's both good. Well, this one shows 99 now too. So now I'm gonna put mask. I will put actually two masks. One is N95. And on top of that, I'll put regular surgical mask. Now I'm wearing two masks and breathing through both masks is a little challenging. So we have to do a little forced inhaling, exhaling. So far my blood saturation didn't drop. It still shows 98 here and 97 here. So I'm still good. And now I'm gonna go and do some exercise on the arm and leg bike, a few minutes to get my heart rate up and see if I lose some oxygen on my blood. All right, here's the results. Let's try to catch up. Okay, my heart rate is 129. I'm breathing heavy, but you can see oxygen level still somewhere 97, 98. This one too, heart rate over 100, but oxygen saturation is still good. 98 so you don't get deprived from oxygen in your brain nor your muscles it is harder to breathe through those masks you probably use your respiratory muscles more so you'll be more tired you burn more calories it's more challenging but you're fitness enthusiasts you love challenges so put on your mask and go work out. You'll be safe. The oxygen level is still 99 and 98. No problem. Go work out, fitness enthusiast. Put a mask on and do a couple hundred burpees. I'll see you next time. Bye.